Alex, I might have a differing of opinion. One just gave you a Ric Flair. Woo! <laughs> One played with Troy Polamalu. It's hard keeping these gators down. Two-time Super Bowl champ, BMAC, Brian McFadden. And uh, you saw the question. You saw the poll answer. Pete, did they have this one wrong? This is a situation. There's no wrong answer in my opinion. Well, no, 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 no. There is a right answer, BMAC. You got to understand something. Okay. I, I witnessed Troy firsthand, mm -hmm. live in color. Yes, you did. One thing about Ed Reed, outstanding yeah. player, Hall of Fame player, first ballot difference maker, impactful type of player. Nothing negative I can say about Ed. But Ed and Troy are two different football players, two different safeties. Ed did all his dirty work in the post. That's why you see the numbers from the interceptions very, very high, high compared to Troy. Sure. Troy always floated around the line Not of scrimmage. scrimmage. He did a lot. Yeah. Troy from the sacks, from just taking on collision blocks with office alignment. Leaping over the line. He, had, he played with no disregard to his body. Mm. Ed Reed didn't do the same because it wasn't, he wasn't called on to do that. When you think about Troy, Troy was basically a linebacker. In our sub package situation, Troy was like a, a dime linebacker for all us. Right, that's all fine and good, but let me ask you this. So when you talk about Ed Reed, the impact that he had, we're talking about a guy that could take an interception and go 106 yards, has the NFL record. In fact, 106 and 107 has the longest of all time, the top two. On top of that, he played special teams as well. So he had an impact on the defensive side of the ball. They both were defensive players of the year, but mm -hmm. Ed Reed has one up on him on all pros and one up on him on Pro Bowls. And the overall impact is one of the greatest. Ed Reed do. has one up on him on pro, all pros and one up on him on Pro Bowls, but Troy has one up on him on rings. Mm. That is And very has true. played in three Super Bowls. Yes, he has. Now, and not to mention, Troy battled injuries throughout the course of his career because so he Ed played had, Ed, reckless. Ed didn't have any injuries either? Later on? You, wait, 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 wait. What about when you was playing against him at Florida State and he had that messed up shoulder? My shoulder hurt, dog. What you Don't ask me if I'm hurt. You, you remember can, that? You can what was the score, what was the score you that game? You're comparing bananas to apple. No, <laughs> right now. you want to say he played with injuries. We're talking and about, played with injuries, we're too. We're talking about professional. Bro, what are you talking hey, about? you played at Florida State. You I basically played, professional. I played you with a broke hand in Florida State. You basically professional at Florida State. It's, not, it's, Florida it's State. not the same. There's no wrong answer. There's no wrong answer. But I saw Troy firsthand. So it's hard for me to go. Outside, I saw Troy firsthand. The hair, everything. I'm just glad you guys aren't passionate about the argument. Listen, <laughs> use that hashtag 122. Final say so. Let us know what you think. Is it Troy Palomalu or is it Ed Reed? And Last but not you. least, if you have a million dollar insurance policy on your hair, you're the best safety. He's got good hair. Yeah, got a deep voice. When we come back. <laughs>